The next thing I'm going to show you is how to play with the broken chord in Silent Night. And again, you don't have to play the melody, and it would be a really nice thing to be able to play this for your family this Christmas. This time I'm going to take the C chord. I'm going to move my second finger down here to middle C so that I can move my thumb down to this G note. So now I actually have four notes on my chord. I've got a G note on the bottom and the top, but it's still a C chord because it's still made up of those same tones, and the whole reason I'm going to do that is so that I can do this. Notice how I'm just rolling the notes of the chord. When I change to the G chord, I'm going to actually make it into a G seventh chord by adding this note on the top. When I play the F chord, I'm going to add an F note on the top. And that gives me a real nice way of playing my chord and you'll notice that the melody is on the top. It's a good idea to try to keep your chord notes below that melody if you can and then we just add that bass note with it and I'm going to sing the melody on the top with it. song Silent Night with a broken chord. Be sure to use your sustain pedal to smooth it out and you don't need to play the melody. A uh, real nice song for your family.